What's up guys, welcome back to another Roblox Studio tutorial video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make shift to sprint in Roblox Studio. So, we can get started by inserting a local script into starter player scripts. And I'll just zoom in so you guys can actually see. And we can do uh, local user input equals game colon get service. And then we're going to do user input service. And then we can go down and we can do local players equals game colon get service and players. And we can go down and we can do local sprint speed is equal to 30. And this is going to be uh, the speed that you're going to want the player to run when they hit shift. And then we can do local walk speed is equal to 16 and that's just the default walk speed in roblox and we can do local player equals players dot local player we can go down and we can do local function and then begin sprint then we're going to do input comma game processed and then we can go down if not game processed then if input dot user input dot type equals equals enum dot user input type dot keyboard then local key code equals input dot key code and then if key code equals equals enum dot key code dot left shift then then we can do player dot character dot humanoid dot walk speed equals sprint speed and then what this is saying is that the our character's walk speed is equal to the sprint speed which we made up here then we can copy this whole thing and then we can go down and we can paste it and instead of begin sprint we can do end sprint and then instead of sprint speed we're gonna do walk speed then we can go down and we can do user input dot input began colon connect and begin sprint and then we can do user input dot input ended colon connect and we can do end sprint all right and I accidentally put a period here where we're not supposed to have it so we can get rid of that real quick and now we can test it up this is just me doing a regular walk and then as soon as i hit shift we go faster and that is how you make a shift to sprint script in Roblox Studio. If this video did help you, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe. The project file for this video will be in my Discord server. The link for the Discord server is in the description, so make sure you go and join that. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.